about these waterfalls is that the beautiful part is in the Argentinian side, but we have to go to Brazil to actually admire this, you know, these uh, these waterfalls. Um, so, uh, gracias, gracias, perfecto. Fabiano, a Portinho from Argentina. Next up, we have Bangladesh. Wearing a Bangladeshi outfit is Nasima. Nasima joins us today. She said, well, I'm wearing an outfit that is half American jeans on the bottom and Bangladeshi on top. So we're grateful for that hybrid outfit today. Thank you, Nasima. And next up, who is this? Is this Pele? Is this Pele? Do we have Pele here today? No, it's Pina Baldi. She's here to invite us to Brazil for the World Cup, for the Olympics. Coming up, she's saying bienvenido. And Pina is what we call a karaoke. Karaoke is the joy of living. She's from Rio, and we're so happy to have you. What do you say about the upcoming events in Brazil? We are so happy and seeing so many beautiful things. It's wonderful. You need to go there. And you think it'll be great for the World Cup and the Olympics? Yes, yes, yes. Ready, ready, ready. <laughs> Abrigado, abrigado, Pina. Next up, we have High C from China. From China. Come on out. High C is wearing what we call a Chi Pao. A chi pao would be used for a party, a special event, she tells me. Something very elegant, and of course she's very elegant too. Let's hand it up for Hai C wearing a beautiful chi pao today. Thank you so much. Thank you. Next up we have Colombia. Colombia, we have Sonia Kushner. Colombia, Gabriel Marquez, you may know the author Gabriel Marquez, A Hundred Years of Solitude, Cartagena, Medellin, the beautiful country of Colombia, Colombian coffee, a beautiful tourism product they're putting together nowadays. And Sonia's wearing the typical folkloric dress. She looks lovely. Let's hand it up. Bravo, Sonia, bravo. Gracias, gracias. Besitos a bracitos. Gracias, Sonia. And next up, we have a wonderful delegation from India. Starting out, we have Arika. She's wearing one of the traditional dresses. And do show off your outfits by walking around the stage. From India, we have such a rich culture, don't we? Mahatma Gandhi reminds us to be the change you want to see in the world. Mahatma Gandhi, and second up we have Shika. Shika? Shika from India wearing a beautiful sari. Look at that, ladies and gentlemen. Oh, I think I want to take that one home. I, you better keep an eye on that. I'm real attracted to that. With the peacocks, you see the peacocks all over the dress. Isn't that beautiful? Mahatma Gandhi also says that poverty is the worst form of violence. Mahatma Gandhi providing such a rich culture. You look so lovely today. Tell us something about your dress. Well, it's sari and we believe that Indian woman looks beautiful in sari. Well, thank you so much. And our third in the delegation from India is Sharda. Sharda is wearing also a lovely, lovely sari. Look at this one. This looks like you could wear this to any kind of cocktail party, any kind of event. Wonderful. How wonderful. Sharda looks beautiful. Let's hand it up to Sharda. So lovely, Sharda. Thank you for joining us today. Look at that, even the detail on the back. How lovely. Thank you. Number four, we have Anita. Anita wearing a lovely, lovely other version of a sari. We have another quote from Mahatma Gandhi who says, a true civilization embraces many cultures. A true civilization embraces many cultures. Look at this detail. That is lovely. 
And before we go on to our next one, let's take a short break. Let's hand it up to David Simmons. What beautiful music he's providing. Thank you, David. Next we have, from the lovely country of Iraq, we have a delegation here. Please come on in and welcome Amira and her sons. Some people say Iraq is the cradle of civilization, the Tigris and Euphrates, the Garden of Eden, beautiful Iraq, now just starting their tourism product after the turmoil. We're so happy to have them. Don't these little boys look great? The beautiful country of Iraq, thank you so much for joining us today. And next we have a Liberia. Liberia, of course, was one of the uh, wonderful countries. Finda is wearing her wedding dress. This could be a wedding dress. This could be a cocktail dress. Let's hand it up to Finda, giving her traditional welcome, her traditional greeting to you today. And as that's happening, I think the sun is trying to come through. Finda, thanks so much for joining us. We're so blessed. Thank you so much. We're so blessed. Oh, la raza. La raza. Arriba, arriba. Arriba, hands across the border. And we have a wonderful person here from Mexico joining us today. It's Maria Reyes. Arriba. La Raza, the wonderful country, Frida Kahlo, Diego Rivera, Carlos Fuente. Carlos Fuente! Carlos Fuentes! Gracias! And shifting climates and different geography, let's go to another part of the world. Nepal! Straight to us from Kathmandu. Come on down. How lovely is this? Notice she's giving her traditional greeting. Isn't that lovely? They're doing a lot with tourism in Nepal these days. A lot of elephant trekking, ecotourism, hiking, cutting edge. And she's giving her greeting. Thank you so very much. It's Shavanki. Oh, and next we do have someone here. If you, if you, I think I'm saying your name right. From Nigeria. And she's wearing another traditional dress. She also sells these things. Jewelry and all these fabrics. That's really lovely too. Oh, look at that. Oh yes, we're shaking it up. Let's hand it up. Oh, Nigeria, thank you so much. Tell me something about your jewelry you're wearing today. I have, this is called Lokana. It represents our tribe from Nigeria, the Niger Delta, and we plant it in every market. And then this is called the judge. The old women see the moon and the star, and then they weave it in the weaving rack and leave it for their daughters during the marriage. How lovely. Let's say thank you to her. Put your hands together. Let's go on that one. Oh, who do we have now? Is this Bobby Burns? Or is Braveheart? Is this Mel Gibson we have? Come on down, Scotland. Oh, what's under that kilt? I think it's Bobby Burns. We got Bobby Burns. Mel Gibson's here today. Yeah. He's wearing a clan tartan. Tell us about your clan tartan. This actually is a tartan of the New World Celts, which is a tartan of the New World Celts, which represents all seven Celtic cultures. Scotland, Ireland, Wales, and so on. And then there's the question, what is this, what is this thing? It, it's a sporin. Well, kilts don't have any pockets. So in the old days, the Scotsman had to have some place to put their cell phones. Okay, well we won't ask you what's under the kilt. We're, we're going to let that go till next year. Maybe next year that will be our quest to find out what's under the kilt. Okay, and next we'll switch to another part of the world, Singapore. Rachel Tran. Rachel Tran, wearing a traditional dress. The beautiful and often um, rumored cleanest country in the world, Singapore. I understand you can get fined if you uh, 
do any littering, and maybe that's good, because we're, we're favoring green here. Rachel, thanks so much for being with us. Lovely, lovely outfit. And next, another Arriba from the land of Miguel de Cervantes, Mother Spain. All right. One of my favorite books, Don Quixote de la Mancha. All right. Pablo Picasso, Salvador Dali. Mother Spain has brought us such beautiful culture. Gracias por su ayuda. And up north we go. We're just moving around the planet so quickly. Now we're up to a Nordic country. Welcome, welcome to Sweden. Sweden. Sweden represented today in a folk dress is Christy Uda. Christy Uda is going to tell us about this folk dress and something you might want to take home a little thought about Sweden. This folk dress was made handmade. Every stitch is hand stitched by my grandmother. It's up from the northern part of Sweden. She got the fabric when she was 15 from her father and she made one with each little village, little town has their own type of own folk dress. Sweden has one that is blue and yellow for the whole country. So, and it's real silver and it's a um, little bit over 50 years old that she handed down to me as a thank you, which I'm really proud of wearing. Thank you so much for joining us, Sweden. We appreciate it. Oh, how lovely. Like I said, we're just zipping around in climate and in geography. Next we have Sri Lanka. Sri Lanka. Isn't this lovely? There she's giving her traditional greeting, namaste. A little fact you may not know about Sri Lanka, the first country to produce the first woman president. That's a pretty wonderful thing, namaste. Thank you so much, Chandra, for joining us. And next we have, representing the United States of America, Native Americans again. <laughs> Ramona Cole is from a Patawani, Patawatani tribe, where Nina Red Cherries, this is Nina Red Cherries, is both Cheyenne and Arapaho. We are so proud to have them. Now let's hand it up for all the wonderful participants in the fashion show and for David Simmons, our wonderful guitar player. Let's all come on. Put your hands together. Put your hands together. Thank you so much. Take this thought home with you. What if we're all brothers and sisters on the planet? We dress differently. We look differently. Our skin is different colors. But perhaps in our heart, we all share something in common. So look to your left and look to your right. You may see people dress differently. They may have different color skin. They may talk differently. But in fact, in your heart, you may share a whole lot in common with them. Thank you so much for joining us. I'm Jody Reed, and I hope you'll come next year and bring some friends. Yeah.